I put on a sweatshirt. This sweatshirt has been in the back of my car for weeks, so if it's a little wrinkly, mind your business, okay? Okay, we're gonna do a giant haul. I still, oh, I still have not recovered yet, you guys. Um, I'm still tired, <laughs> I'm exhausted. We're gonna do a big haul of all of this stuff that we've like accumulated for the house. We're trying to fill up a big house, you guys, with no stuff at all. So we had to buy so much stuff. Um, so tired, right? I think we just need to get some food right now. Okay, well I'm gonna finish this haul. You figure out what food you wanna eat. I'm gonna need a dinner time soon now. This guy wants to eat din tai. I would be down, you guys wanna come to din tai with us? Um, okay, first things first that I'm super excited about is like this is all from like IKEA, Home Goods, and Costco, right? The first things that I'm super excited about are these little um, storage bins that I got at Home Goods. They're for like, what is it called? It's like seal tight or what's it called? Airtight. Airtight, seal tight, seal proof, bulletproof. Bro, what are you <laughs> they are like you know those airtight containers where you can store like your pasta and your food in because i do not like at all when we open up the cabinet and then it's just like chip bags and pasta and like all that stuff i would rather just put all the pasta in one of these like all the chip you know what i mean like organize it so i got two big ones these were 9.99 at tj maxx so two big ones and then i got two of these medium sized ones right here and I may need to go back and get more, but I figured this was enough for now. And then I got one of these like little chubby fat ones. So these are the tall skinny ones, chubby short fat ones. Super excited. I need to put these in the dishwasher before I use them obviously. So we'll do that. And then I'll show you guys how I'm gonna organize all the food in there once we get to that part. Okay, what else do we get from Home Goods? I also got Dexter new beds. He's, I think he sees this and thinks that it means like come over here. We're working on my training of Dexter, so sometimes, you know. We got Dexter two more of these because he was just stinking up. I think I might have told you this in a vlog earlier. I don't know if it made it in. He smells like corn chips sometimes. We got him these, two of them. He's sitting on another one over there, okay? Then in here, we got these little um, kitchen towels. It's a three set. They're kind of like striped with a little bit of like, is that blue or gray? What is that color? I don't know, but they look like this. They have frill on the bottom. Home good. It's a pack of three. In gray tan. Yeah, made in Turkey. Made in Turkey. That's where we're going. <laughs> anyway, um, we got these just extra hand towels. We're in need of like a lot more towels. I feel like we run out of towels really quickly, at least in our old house. So I've got a lot more towels for around the house. These are nice. Then at Target yesterday, we bought this big fat blanket. I think we're going to like probably like hang this over the couch when it comes or like leave in the living room maybe or it might be um in the bedroom yeah anyway we haven't figured out what we're gonna no, do no, with no, this no. we're just in the closet just for when people are there. just for cozy i want to get one of those big baskets to put blankets in that's what i'm saying okay anyway big blanket this was i think like 60 dollars. it's a full size like it's a queen size full queen size one bruh it's a big one, so honestly, I feel like it was worth it for the price since it's so big and heavy. Had this been any smaller, I think we just need to get some food right now. Had this been any smaller, no go, but we decided we're like, look, it's so soft and big and chunky and the perfect like cuddle up in cozy weather, drink a hot chocolate, watch a movie. Perfect blanket for that. So, got this. Haven't opened it yet because we just don't, as you can see, we're sitting on, we have nothing, you know, we have nothing. We're sitting on the floor. Um, then at Ikea, we actually bought one of these um, pillow stuff things that they have, like the actual pillow. Um, and then we bought a cover for it. This is bigger than I think we anticipated. I, thought, I think we thought it was going to be smaller. And this is the perfect size. It's just one of these, and then we also bought a cover for it. What's this for? It's for this cover. This green cover is going to go on it because we really want to do, like, I like a very neutral scheme in our house but it's not very inviting when you have very neutral like basic colors so we're doing like a pop of like sagey matcha -y green around the house and maybe some blues when we find some ones that we like uh, <laughs> in the store this guy was smacking me upside the head with the <laughs> with the pillow almost knocked me out <laughs> this is the cover that we got for it it's like a little velvety one does this fit on here 
I guess so. So yeah, it'll be like that. Can you put this cover on? I like that. I told you. I know. I think he picked it. I really think he did. Anyway, that's that. We're just going all over the place. Then at Ikea, we also got all of these house slippers. We got two different sizes, the small size and the big size, because when we come to our, when you come to our house, there's no, there's no shoes in the house. I'm so sorry about it. There's no shoes in the house. You come in, you get a pair of slippers, you get a pair of socks if you need a pair of socks. We're not doing that. Sorry if I keep licking my lips. My lips are dry, you guys, because we've been dehydrated because all we've been doing is running around. Sorry. It looks like you're a green bean right now. Green, green, green. Anyway, so slippers as soon as you come in the house. Love that. My mom used to do that at our house when I was younger, and Jay brought up the idea, and I'm like, absolutely, let's do it. So these will go downstairs in a bucket for people. And then I bought a bunch of tea lights because I like to use the tea lights in like the back of my YouTube videos, and also power outage in the house tea lights. Like, come on, we're thinking, we're thinking of, we're thinking ahead, okay? Um, tea lights, gorgeous. This reminds me of my mom. My mom always had a stack of tea lights in the in the cabinet. So, how to get those in honor of her? Gosh, you have to around this guy. Your reflexes have to be perfect. I love it. This would be cute on the bed. Yeah, good job. Good picking. Yeah. So this is what it looks like with the cover and the thing. When is the couch here? When is it? Yeah, Wednesday. Have to wait till Wednesday for our couch, you guys. <laughs> Moving on, you guys already know about these buckets. I think if you've watched my channel before, I put all my makeup in these buckets and at Ikea they had these ones that have a little bit more depth to them than the other ones that I have. I was under the impression that I could stand up my foundations in here and only some of them can stand up in here. So we'll see. I want to do a whole organization video with you guys for like my makeup and like all my like products. You know me. Oh, I have a bunch of products <laughs> downstairs in the little office. So I bought a couple small ones and we'll figure out together how we want to organize that, you, you, you guys and I. And these are my favorite. They're affordable. They look super clean and you can fit a whole bunch of stuff in here. And they come in like all these different sizes, which I absolutely love. And I also love that these come with a lid. It's not like those normal acrylic organizers that have no lid. I love that you can like close it off completely. 10 out of 10. If you go to Ikea, get those. Sorry this is like so scattered, but you guys are just gonna have to bear with us because you know, we're working with a little. We're working with very little. We got this little blanket too. This is a little throw blanket. Um, we just liked it because it matched the kind of like green matcha sage vibe that we're going for. Just a hint, a hint, an extra, ugh, <laughs> an extra hint for around the house. Maybe just like somewhere. It's actually quite small, quite small. No one would be able to cuddle up in that. Well, actually, maybe. On a hot summer's day. Anyway, another throw pillow. I mean, throw blanket. 10 out of 10. Wouldn't recommend. I'm just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. We also got these little glass jars with like the cork top because we're gonna replace like juices, maybe smoothies, whatever, and put them in here. My milk is gonna go in here, oat milk. We'll go in here to put in the fridge because I think it just makes everything, this is so unnecessary by the way. So just me being completely unnecessary. Everything that um, comes in like a regular package, I feel like makes the fridge look ugly and cluttered. But when you repackage it into this kind of stuff, not only does it make you want to use it more and you're like, oh, that looks so good. It's like tricking your brain, but it also just looks better when you open the fridge. It looks so much more organized. Again, so unnecessary, but like, you can't pass up on these. Yes, we can. You can't. You really can't. So I, I can't wait. I'm going to put them in the washer and then like literally swap out everything in the fridge. <laughs> I got this little teapot for Jay for his um, teas. Well, I guess it's for both of us, but honestly, I was thinking of him when I got it. Um, so it has a little like tea infuser already in it and it's a little like glass pot. So I figure you just, what, you put your tea in here? How do you do it? I haven't quite figured that out yet, you guys. If you know how to do it, let me know. It's a tea infuser. I'll figure that out later. But I thought it was super cute. Just very simple, very plain, easy way to drink your tea in the morning. I'm loving the little glass vibe we have going on here, you know? Very aesthetic. Aesthetically pleasing. Then we got these little cleaning gloves. These are like matcha green color as well. But I got these because I don't like to do the dishes because I don't like to touch the gunk in the dish area. 
So I'm going to be putting these on because I watched Kayla. I don't know. I don't know her last name. Kayla. Okay. Kayla on YouTube. She has a little baby. She's married. You guys know who I'm talking about. Okay. She always wears dish gloves when she's watching the, when she's washing the dishes. So I'm like, okay, getting a pair of dish gloves. Got two of them. And now we're washing the dishes with gloves only. Okay. Get to it. We have, um, we have a glass bath. I, I don't know why in, in my head we had two, but we have only one. Um, our bathroom doesn't have a shower curtain. It's just like glass. So I got one of these squeegees to just squeegee down the, uh, the glass in there to keep it from getting all dirty and gross. So got one of those, but I mean, got two of these cause I, I don't know why I thought both bathrooms had it, but the other one needs a shower curtain. So these, I guess we have an extra just for fun. Little green scrubby for the dishes. Scrub, 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 scrub. Matches the green vibe. You, you see the theme going on here. What's this? What are these? Oh. Okay. It's like to, to cap bottles, like wine bottles or something like that. You just stick that on there and then they are closed. I didn't know that I bought these. <laughs> I probably saw them and just like literally put them in really quick. Next, we have these big bowls. This is what we pretty much eat everything out of. We have like this Ikea set. They're like the cheapest bowls that are at Ikea but I just love like this bowl. I like to eat salmon and rice out of this. I like to eat spaghetti out of this. I like to eat literally anything you can eat. I like to eat out of this cereal, all of it. Like we could get rid of every single other dish. We don't even need plates at this point because I'm eating it out of this. So I got three more of these to add to our set just so we have a couple more. Then you guys already know about the Ikea bath mats. We got a bunch of them. So I got one for the, it's like an extra long one. I feel like they just came out with this. I haven't never seen this before. This one I'm gonna put in the kitchen since it's like a super long one. And then I got one for the bathroom upstairs, outside of the shower. Then I got another one for the other bathroom. And then I guess I got another one from for the other bathroom because <laughs> I got all of these for that. I don't even know. I thought I picked smaller ones, but I guess I didn't. I guess I just got all the same size, which is fine. And then the one large one. So there you go. I feel like everybody and their mom knows about these from Ikea. Everyone has them. Oh! Behind me, we got this pack of two Euro pillows from um, Home Goods. Since our bedding is all white, we're gonna do these big pillows just to kind of make it feel like more luxe, more hotel-y. Um, these are big ones, so technically for like a queen bed, I feel like you would do a little bit smaller, but when you do oversized pillows, I learned this trick from, um, who is she on on youtube i watched a video for her if i if i can remember i'll tag her her ch list her channel down below she does a lot of like home decor videos but she said using the bigger pillows make your bed look like more luxe when you do that so we got two of these came in two pack i think it was like 30 dollars for two of these i don't know not too bad then next i think this is the last i think these are the last things we got this big blanket we already slept in these but we got this big blanket from costco it's kind of like this bluish gray color uh we just love like cuddly blankets like this around the house at all times you know watching tv in the bed whatever it is you need a blanket like this okay if people are over you know you just need them and then look at this huge pile of mess i'm making then this one same vibe but it's like a light you know like shimmery silvery gray color i think we might use this on our bed upstairs this one is so this one is from costco and this one is from home goods or tj maxx i think home goods we got this one even though it's all it's pretty much the same thing but we got this specifically at a home goods store super soft so cozy we also bought these i have two you're sitting you guys are sitting on the other one these are our nightstands that we got from Urban Outfitters. Um, they were on sale. Hopefully that means that they're, hopefully, you know, they're not ugly. Yes! What do you think? You like them? This is gonna be our side table. I think it's cute. So you can like twist it around so that this part's showing or you can twist it so that it's like this, whatever you choose, but you can lay like books in here, simple stuff, you know? It's not too big, they're like really simple, but I just, first of all, they were on sale, so I'm like, why not? And I think they're on sale for, I think they ended up being $60 each when they're originally 200 and something dollars each. So like, I don't know what kind of sale was going on, but I was like, okay, let me just get them because Furniture is expensive, so if there's a sale, you might as well just hop on it. 
But yeah, we got two of these, so I'll be putting these upstairs by the bed, and that's pretty much it. I think that's all we got in this little, in this little haul. I mean, I'm sure there's other stuff, like, around the house, but these are the main, these are the main things. And then our couch is going to come in a few days, our bed is going to come, who knows when. But that's everything for right now.